I don't know when you said this, but at some point you said or wrote that there are only two kind of days, um, good days and great days. Right. That was after I was diagnosed. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think it, I think I read that before I knew you Yeah. and I just internalized it, you know, and then I talked to my kids about it Mm -hmm. and then they've talked to their friends about it. And it's just, it's what I was thinking about when you said, you know, today's the perfect day. right? Right. So, yeah, I mean, it's, and on, I mean, I, I think had I not been, so that statement or quote came after um, I was diagnosed and, and cured and back to reality, sport and life and family. Um, without that period of my life, so that call it a year of diagnosis, treatment, follow up, it's really like a two year period there where you're just like, oh, am I going to live or am I going to die? What's the deal? <laughs> Um, without that two year period, like the last seven years, I I might've been curled up Mm -hmm. and I might've been begging for mercy and I might've been hooked on oxys and homeless. I mean, I don't know. So, uh, for that, I'm very thankful that I went through that experience. I mean, the last seven years of, there's been times that completely sucked, but relative to, you know, 96 and 97, Mm -hmm. no, (laughs) it hasn't been that bad. (laughs) 